Ava, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Now you're like, um, I don't know if I should be doing what I'm about to do because the Penny fam is watching. Were you gonna jump on the couch? Yeah. Oh, you crazy girl. Hi, Mama. Hi, Ruby. I'm jumping down. Yeah, I know, I saw you. Hey, 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 no, get down. Get down, please. Thank you. What are you doing, Mr. Christopher Pena? That was cringy. <laughs> don't put that in there. <laughs> no, I'm putting that in no, there. Don't. No, I'm putting that in there. You know why? Why? You know why, guys? I'm putting that in there because I am going to try to be less picky about our vlogs and put our real life in here because... Sometimes I feel like I'm a little too picky and I spend like 10 hours editing and I just can't do that anymore. With two kids, I just yeah. can't. It's like really stressful. So you're gonna get our real life. Yeah, sounds I, good I to feel me. like I try to make this like a show, like an entertaining show for you guys. <laughs> okay, just don't be judging me, all right? Cause I'm crazy. <laughs> But like, this is real life and I can't, like, I feel like you guys will watch us either way. Like, yeah. we don't have to be perfect for, for you sure. guys. For sure, I've been telling her for months that this has happened and yesterday, I think she had a little bit of a realization or a breakdown. And <laughs> or a breakdown? <laughs> if you follow us on Instagram, you probably know what I'm talking about. Yeah. She's like such an overachiever and she like really just doesn't give herself enough credit and I think she finally yeah. realizes that you know, she needs to like calm down a little bit and separate Guys, work from life. I don't know how to chill and yeah. I'm like a perfectionist and I kind of did have a breakdown like Chris said because I felt guilty for not posting as much as, okay, you gotta go. Sorry, yeah, I really have to go. <laughs> I hate being late to places and I have yeah, like go, go, go. 10, 15 minutes to get there. I'll explain what And I doing. still have to take her out. Come here, Blue. Go outside, baby. Go so potty. Chris is taking her potty right now, Blue, because Blue actually has her first training. If you guys don't know, if you're new to our channel, we have a puppy. She is almost 20 weeks old, I believe. Uh-oh, Stella's crying. Um, she's almost 20 weeks old and she is not trained at all. I mean, she knows how to sit, but that's about it. And you guys know we have a newborn and a one-year-old and we need a trained dog. So Chris is taking her to her first training. Stella over gonna here. Crazy. It's gonna be crazy because Blue doesn't really, she, not that she doesn't listen to us, but she's very, um, she's very much still a puppy. <laughs> It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I know, I need to change your diaper, huh? I think she just, just pooped. Oh, thank you, baby. What are you giving me, milk? Why does this milk look weird? I think that's just the way the milk is because I just gave her this milk and I smelled it and it was fine. So yeah, she's still very much like a puppy. She's still hyper, she's still teething. I know, you guys probably think we're crazy because we have a brand new puppy, a brand new baby, and a one-year-old, but that's just us, this is our life. You wanna judge us? We really don't care. We love this crazy, hectic life. Ava, what are you doing? You're playing with the lens? She what? She went pee and poop real quick. Good. She only goes if we're not out there. I know. Oh yeah, that's another thing. She is, wasn't really potty trained, but since we, since we got her her crate, um, she's been not peeing and pooping in the house, which is amazing. She holds her pee throughout the night, so that's really good. Um, and I saw a couple comments saying that she needs a bigger crate and she honestly doesn't you guys like as long as the crate is big enough To where they can what is it turn around babe? What are they stand supposed to have? Turn stand up and turn around. That's the size Love, Love you. you. That's the size that Love they you. need. Love you Stella. Bye, <laughs> Bye Ava. See you in a little bit yeah. um, That's the size that they need to you know train or whatever it's called. I really don't know what it's called <laughs> Dragging her out. 
I really hope this training helps, you guys, because she's a crazy puppy. We love her to death, but she's honestly a crazy puppy, and she needs this training really bad. But yeah, we bought her that small crate for a reason, because as long as she can stand up and turn around in it, she's Gucci. That's just what they recommended to us, and I totally believe it, because we used to do crate training with our other puppy, the, our first puppy that Chris and I got together. But yeah, the crate is good for her right now, and then as she gets a little bit bigger, we will buy a bigger crate. But what's up, Penny fam? I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Sorry. I didn't say that already. So what's wrong, baby? Look at that face. I haven't properly shown you guys Stella right now. Comment down below if you think she's just growing so freaking fast, you guys. Doesn't her head look like 10 times bigger than the last vlog? Oh, and I guess you found out how to open the box, huh? Yeah. What are you doing? Fam. Oh, Pena Fam? Yeah. Are you playing with the Pena Fam? Cause that's the camera lens. <gasps> She's so smart. Oh, what? Oh no, Penny. Oh no, the Penny Fam. Did it fall? Yeah. Do you think that's called the Penny Fam? <laughs> she thinks the lens is called Penny Fam. That's so funny. So I just want to apologize, even though I don't need to. I want to apologize because I'm a people pleaser, as I discovered last night. That I am sorry for not vlogging as much, um, but I realized that most people when they have a baby, they usually take maternity leave and you know, take a break for at least like six weeks and I haven't done that. I literally posted and edited the video of Stella being born in the hospital I'm crazy, and um, we continue to vlog ever since she was born and I'm realizing that I just I shouldn't, not that I shouldn't have done that, but I should have just taken a little bit of time for myself, and I just didn't. So last night, Chris took away my phone. Yes, like a parent, he took away my phone. And, oh no, Penny fam. And he was like, you need to chill. You don't know how to chill. You need to sit down and relax. So we relaxed for about an hour, and it was amazing, you guys. Like, I forgot how to relax. I'm realizing it's super important when you have a baby or when you have two kids or three kids, whatever, to take time for yourself. And not just like, oh, I need mommy time. I'm going to go out with the girls. Like, not like that. That's not what I mean at all. I just mean, like, take 30 minutes and go, like, shower or, like, shave your armpits. Things like that that you can't really do when you have two little kids. So last night was awesome. I relaxed. I freaking have been wearing my retainers again, like just the little things like that. Um, I have been doing my nightly routine with my face. Little things like that add up when you stop doing them and it honestly makes a difference to take care of yourself. So that is what I'm focusing on. I'm focusing on taking care of myself Obviously, along with taking care of my kids, I always put my kids first, but making the extra effort to take care of myself too because I feel like that's really important and I feel like that message just needed to be sent out into the world because I feel like I'm not the only one out there like this. Whether you're a mom or a dad or just a workaholic like myself, just take some time for yourself because it is super important for your health and I realize that being a perfectionist is a sickness and it's not healthy at all. I, you guys probably don't know because I've never, I'm gonna get emotional, but I've never like vented about it to you guys. I'm just like a little bit of a perfectionist. I want everything to be perfect all the time. She's pooping right now. Oh, yes, honey, get it. Get it, hunty. She is pooping. I always want my house to be clean. I always want things to be in place. I always want my kids to look well-dressed and perfect and that's how I want myself to be as well. But it's just not reality and I just can't do it anymore and especially with YouTube I want to vlog every single day. I want to vlog for you guys and edit the videos and post them and just like throw them out there for you guys. But I just can't do it. Like I can't do it all myself and I'm realizing that. If you're controlling like me you will totally know what I'm talking about when I say that I want to do everything myself. Like I literally want to do everything myself. And that's just not possible. So no, I'm not quitting YouTube. I know a lot of people were asking that when I posted on Instagram saying like that I was just overwhelmed. No, I'm not quitting YouTube. I love YouTube and I'm always going to do YouTube as long as I possibly can. But when you work from home, because obviously, you know, YouTube is our work. Our life is our work and our work is our life kind of. And that's not really the healthiest situation. So I just need to work on separating family time Mom. and work time. What, baby? Mama found it. You found it? What'd you find? Pen, pen, pen. You found the pen, you fam? 
Mama, you found Pin Fam piece. Oh, you want me to find the Penny Fam? Did you drop the little piece of the lens? Yeah. Chris is gonna be like, why are you letting her play with the lens? Um, so I just need to work on separating family time and work time and knowing the difference because I never can just chill. This is just me realizing that I can't do it all and it's okay to feel a little overwhelmed and it's okay to feel a little stressed out, but it doesn't have to be that way. So as for YouTube, I am going to try my best, just like I have been, to try to post as much as we can, but if I don't post, Say I miss like two days, I'm not gonna go cry about it and feel guilty and feel like I let you know all of you guys down because I'm still a mom. I'm doing like 10 different jobs in one person. Unless you have kids, you don't realize how hard it is to be a parent and that being a parent is just a huge job in itself. But when you add the full-time nanny, the full-time cleaning lady, the full-time chef, like th those are a lot of jobs and they're jobs in itself. So adding them all together is just like, a hot mess and then on top of all those full-time jobs you add your full-time actual job which for me it's YouTube I know I'm talking way too much but honestly this is what this video is kind of for anyway because I need to update you guys on the reality of things I am gonna continue doing YouTube I love doing YouTube but just bear with me and please don't comment like when are you gonna post a video if we miss say two days or something because it is hard and I'm trying my best just know that I'm trying my absolute best anyway I know you guys appreciate the realness um, this is me this is our life we're never gonna be fake here on YouTube so if you want this picture-perfect family couple goals family goals whatever this is probably not the place for you I mean if you still think we're family goals then that's great we love and appreciate you guys but I'm tired of putting on a show and making every single vlog perfect like even with editing you guys I literally spend hours editing because I'm trying to put on this perfect show and entertain you guys and put out good content but I realized like I could still vlog this like the baby crying and you guys would still watch it because this is real so if the vlogs feel a little bit slower paced maybe not as fast paced as they usually are that is why because I'm really gonna try to just keep it real with you guys even though I have been trying to keep it real I've honestly not it's not real enough. I try to paint this picture perfect life for you guys and it's just not reality. So if you've made it this far in the video without skipping, thank you. Thank you for listening to me. Thank you to everyone who watches our videos and who is sticking with us. Bye. <laughs> bye, Penny Ava's like, bye, bye, Penny Fan, because she thinks I'm ending the vlog. You're so cute, Ava. Bye, people. <laughs> and thank you to everyone who's going to continue watching our vlogs. Um, we really appreciate it. We love you guys so freaking much. Forget the haters and the judges. I'm over it. I'm so over trying to please everyone. Can you say thank you to the Pena fam? Thank you, people. Does she Pena fam? Mm -hmm. Mwah. Big lips. Mwah. I love you. We're actually gonna get ready for the day and vlog, um, but that will be up tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little update. I know it was just me talking a lot. I'm sorry, but sorry, not sorry. If you're a real Penny family member, you will understand. We are back, we are better, and I hope you guys like the new Amanda and the new Penny family vlogs because things are about to change over here for the better. <laughs> what are you doing? You know we don't let you do that, Ava. <laughs> Ava, stop, please. Okay, I should not be laughing. Ava, can you stop? Thank you. You want to go to Ava's room? Yeah. Okay. Oh, by the way, guys, I fixed these two rooms up, the formal um, living room and the formal dining room. So if you guys want a tour of that, I will definitely put that in the next vlog. You want to play in Ava's room? Yeah. Should we get you ready for the day? Yeah. Okay, can we end the vlog right here, the video? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, what, baby? Clean. You're cleaning? Yeah. Good job. So even though this isn't really a vlog, I still want to give the shout out for today. So today's shout out goes to, today's shout out goes to Minnie Cassandra. Shout out to you, girl. Thank you so much for, <laughs> Ah, send help. <sighs> okay, she's on the boob. Shout out to you, girl. Thank you so much for always liking, commenting, subscribing. We love you so much. So like always, if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to give it a... Big thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel and you aren't subscribed already... <gasps> what are you doing? She knows the whole outro. Oh my goodness. What are you doing? Make sure to click that subscribe button because we do vlog... 
daily. Oh my gosh. Let's see if she knows the last part. But we love you guys and we'll see you next time. Next time. Be, be, do, mm.